Hello everyone, welcome back. As you can see, I have a new outfit. I uh, found this guy who is called, let me see, the White Dye Merchant, somewhere in the mountains, over here. So he provided me with the white color of my armor. In the last episode, I told you that I would liberate some villages um, in progression to that legend of... I'm not good with these names. Legend of Gozaku. So I liberated those villages and I think I have two more left. One is situated over here. And the last one is right under the blue icon. So I think I'm going to keep that for a later part of the video. Right now I am going to help the monks right here or I can do a kanji tail. Let's see. I'm pretty excited to see what happens here. So I think I'm going to do this one first and then I might do one of these two. And then I'm going to liberate one or two villages and maybe finish that legendary tale. So busy episode. Now let's see where a point is where we can fast travel to. Pillar of Honor. Pretty close enough. Hope you're all doing okay. Thank you for joining me. This game is accelerating in intensity because uh, I realized it in this second area of the map in Act 2. The enemies are way more hard to defeat and uh, I have to make use of all my skill sets to make sure that I don't die easy. <laughs> so let's see how far we are removed, okay? That's about 300 meters, alright. I think we should call the horse for that. Yeah, I thought for the majority of the game I've been in the color of black and now I wanted to change into white. I don't think it influences how fast the enemies will spot me when I'm trying to sneak past them. So everything should be good. And everything is very misty right now. Where do I have to go? In here? Yeah, should be here. This is a particular area. Oh, careful. Careful people. Coming through. Right into the action, I see. Whoa, these dogs. They've been implementing way more of these dogs. Very hard to dodge if you're in the heat of combat. See? They're fast. Is this it? That wasn't too bad, but of course I've been practicing a little bit. Yeah, where do we have to go? Defeat the Mongols? Well, I did that, didn't I? So, um, last time I told you that I was going to liberate those villages because I thought for the purpose of the videos it would become a little bit repetitive and <laughs> I was right. The first two were pretty much okay it was it was fun but then after a while it got repetitive as i predicted so um you didn't really miss anything and i saved the last one or two 
so I could show you what it is exactly that I had to do. But I don't know what I have to do now. The guy called me, but oh. Oh, there is one more. That should do it. My lord, look what they've done! Kushidera Temple deserves reverence, not bloodshed. Centuries of wisdom lie within those walls, and the Mongols were ready to torch it all to the ground. They attacked for a reason. The temple gives people hope! The abbot's been telling people to pray for a great storm to wash the invaders from our home. Now the abbot's missing. And the brutes stole the most sacred relic in Toyotama, a statue of Buddha, carved at the temple's founding. My brother would have recovered them. He would have given these monks hope before they ran for the hills. And we honor his memory and restore the temple. The Mongols stole the statue of Buddha from the main hall. And the abbot? He and his closest followers fled. I'm hoping they found shelter. The birth of suffering. They were very creative with their titles, don't you think? I'll see to the monks. Aren't we doing this mission already? Oh. Well then, let's activate one. I hope Abbot Kome is safe. The Blood Sutra. The Abbot is from Cedar Temple. Why did he well, come? at least this time so we didn't have to travel far to start a mission. But when they attacked, he escaped. The battle was chaotic. It might be difficult to track them. There's a farm nearby that supports the temple. We'll start there. Let's talk to this guy first. I'm sure we'll find the Abbot Kume there. It would be wise for you to seek aid from Kami. Their shrines lie beyond the Tori. Oh, he has a. Um, Sometimes I wonder if they hear our prayers. Smooth They're voice. Always listening and watching. If you persist in your efforts. If you persist in your works. efforts. Thank you. I'll keep trying. And another one. I think the Mongols are afraid of our hot springs, Lord Sakai. They avoid them. Hmm. Perhaps they don't like the smell of sulfur. Or they're afraid taking a bath will make them sick. Let's hope they stay afraid, my lord. If any warrior is going to gain strength from Tsushima's hot springs, it should be you. I can't argue with that. Then again, it's hard to argue with a monk. These are dark times, my lord. It would be wise for you to seek aid from Kami. Their shrines lie beyond the Toriyi gates. Sometimes I wonder if they hear our prayers. They're always listening and watching. If you persist in your efforts, they will answer. Thank you. I'll keep trying. Norio's probably waiting for me. Come on, man. How many text balloons are left? I can see one. It's probably the last guy we have to talk to. These are dark times, my lord. It would be wise for you to seek aid from Kami. Their shrines lie beyond the Toriyi gates. Sometimes I wonder if they hear our prayers. They're always listening and watching. If you persist in your efforts, they will answer. Thank you. I'll keep trying. All right, Norio, I'm coming. Okay. Lead the way, oh. my friend. 
or I will lead the way to a place I don't know where this it is. This reminds me of another time Abbot Kome went missing. The temple was divided by a feud between our senior monks. Fox then. That will be for a later time. But it seemed important oh, look how pretty. The abbot disappeared for a week. We dropped everything to look for him. What happened to him? He hid from us. Oh, it's this way. And we stopped fighting in order to find him. He's a cunning leader. Another time, my brother and the healer, Hochi, were fighting. The abbot started carrying a rock everywhere, arguing with it night and day. Hochi and Enjo were so embarrassed, they reconciled. How did your brother feel about the abbot? Enjo respected him, like a father. If the Mongols capture the abbot, it could work out well for us. It sounds like he tricked them into giving up the invasion. <laughs> You're beginning to understand abbot Kome. How should we deal with the Mongols? If they see us, they could threaten the hostages. I'll go in alone. You want me to sit here while the abbot's life is in danger? Stay focused, Norio. This is the best way to save him. Go, before I change my mind. There's a bridge in the middle of the farm. I'll meet you there when it's safe. So we probably have to be sneaky sneaky. Man, I love the world design. With the fire in the distance, and the waterfalls, and then the clouds, the hills, and then that bridge, high up there, and the water here. I mean, you know, when you are looking forward to a game about samurai or any eastern story, this is the type of world that you are waiting for, that you want to see. It's almost like um, back in the days when those Lord of the Rings games were out and you saw the movies and you think about Rivendell, how beautiful that was in the movies. And you, you hoped every time a new Lord of the Rings game came out, I want this city to look as real and as authentic as possible in this game. And that's kind of the feeling I'm getting now because this right here, this is what I was hoping to see before starting this game. I don't think I can kill this guy with a bow. Probably have to go down and sneak up behind him. I know. How many are left? Oh, I can see one. Let's just hope he stays there. Uh, risky. Yeah, it'll be fine. Is it safe enough? So that's a horse, but what's what's in the distance over there? Oh, that's um, Norio, I think. Yeah, okay, now she's calling for me. Wait a minute. Yeah. No, 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 no! Crap. You're going to be all right. Yeah, yeah, no time for dawdling. Get out of there. Supplies. Okay, I have to save two more hostages. Ah. 
and I missed. Man. No, no, no. <laughs> Every time I see one of the, these guys blow their horns, I get worked up. And so far it hasn't been that bad. Probably one guy, two guys in this house, okay. Now let's be quiet. That guy, okay. So, I learned a new skill. And I think you saw that in the last video. Actually, I can kill guys like this. See? Quickly get this one. See? My assassination game improved a little bit. You'll be free soon. They're looking for the abbot. So am I. He came with the other monks, but I didn't see him after the attack. Well, there is one more hostage to save. Is he standing behind there? No. That's the guy on top. Who is here? Oh. That's probably where he is going to meet me, right? Norio? That's one. One more over there. I might kill him with the longbow also. What? Come on, that was good. Okay. Quickly. Okay, I need to position myself a little bit better. That should do it. Please help me. You're going to be all right. We thought our farm was lost, Lord Sakai. Did the Mongols take your key to Kosaka's armor? No. You may have it. If more Mongols come, they'll get nothing from us. Another key. Okay. Oh yeah, so it's yeah, that that was one of the villages I had to do. That's good then. Defend the hostages. Where? The wind isn't showing me anything. Oh, now it is. How many hostages do I still have to save?
Oh, I see. So I just have to kill the remaining Mongols and then that should be it. Can't let that dog see us. Let's climb up here a little bit further. Okay, how many are left? I see three. Maybe we should go on higher ground. Kill one with the bow and then go in. Okay, I have one arrow left. With a headshot, that should do it. And I missed again. Jesus Christ. Oh, no way. Ah, come on, stupid dog. These were two quests at the same time, no? Oh, okay. Whoa, a lot of question marks. Now we can meet Norio at the bridge. Did you find the abbot? Not yet, but he was here. He may still be. Have you checked the source of the fire? Let's go. My lord, you're too late. Where is the abbot? He was hiding in that house. They burned it to the ground. Is, it, is this him? The abbot? The bastards love the fire, don't they? He's not the abbot. Just one of his followers. Keep searching. He's dead. Burned alive. Are you? Water barrels. Tipped over. Straw bedding. Hmm. Damn. Could the abbot have saved himself? Yeah, it's possible. He protected himself with wet bedding. Escaped out the back. Maybe he survived. Whoever survived the fire went this way. Then there's still hope. The tracks. Here are the tracks. Footprints are heavier, farther apart. He was running. Is that him? Who will fight?
Wait a minute, but which way? Oh, okay. I have to go up the stairs. No, this is probably the wrong way. Someone was wounded here. Follow the blood. Okay. So it Hurry was the right, <laughs> it was the right way. Okay, more blood. Okay, assassination attempt failed. Yeah, there is something here. It seems like someone jumped down here. More blood. He jumped down. Should I jump? All right. That would have been bad if it wasn't deep enough. I suppose he went through the waterfall. That's what I would do. Blood on the rocks. Is that a cave? Someone here? No. Is he? I'm sorry, Norio. Without his leadership, the monks will leave. And the temple will fall. The Mongols won. What's that next to him? A Lotus Sutra. Written in the abbot's blood. His final act. Like a samurai's death poem. The point of this sutra is that we can all be Buddhas. From the lowest peasant to the greatest noble. Written with his dying breath. Not for himself, but for those he left behind. Show the sutra to the monks. If they see the abbot's devotion, they might stay. And this is the sutra the abbot wrote in his own blood. A final act of devotion. A call to stand up to cruelty. A call to stay and not surrender. We will honor the abbot's sacrifice, Norio. We must not let Kushi Temple fall. Enjo the Guardian saved us once. Now his brother and Lord Sakai have saved us again. And together we can defeat the Mongols. Good. More allies. Charm of Resistance 2. Let's see what this does. Reduces all damage by a moderate amount. Yeah, I might equip that one. Oh, but I already have one. Well, then it's okay. Now we need to find the statue of Buddha. Oh. So, tale number six is right here. There are so many things to do. Okay, I am going to liberate the last village. 
and then I'm going to finish the Unbreakable Gusaku quest. So let's find a place to fast travel to. Because like I said, the legendary missions are among my favorites. So in each village we have to save either three or four people. And as soon as you save the last person he will give you one of the keys. And I think I have five already. Which means one more left. And he is going to give us a key now, normally. Oh. You saved us. Did they find your key to Gosaku's armor? Ha. They could have the key for all I care. Gosaku is a hero from a children's story. You don't believe the armor exists? Not at all. Take our key and see for yourself, my lord. That's the last key. The musician said the armor is atop a hill in Akashima. And I think that's where we are, no? And now the village is going to restore to its normal life. That's my favorite part of all this. That's something they um, they took from the Witcher. Well, took. The, the Witcher 3 inspired them to do this as well. If you liberate a village, you can see the direct consequences of that. Now let's see where we have to go. See, this one is liberated. And now we just have to find... Wait, this is... Yeah, this is the one. And now in this area, so far everything has been done. Only those question marks, but... Those are the side-side quests. And they're pretty much all the same. So I'm going to travel here. I can't? What, combat? Which combat? There is no combat going on. Let's try that again, shall we? Fast travel to... Why is the game telling me there is combat? Okay, maybe just travel a bit further away from here and then we can try again. We good now? Still not good. Alright, then I will travel manually. Let's try again. I think there is a bug in the game. Or maybe they want us to travel this far. Holy guacamole. <laughs> it's literally from one side of the map to... Over there. Okay, that was a long travel. So actually I had to... Um, do a little side quest first. Just saving someone on the road and then... Fast traveling was enabled again. And I discovered that pretty much at the last second. So, this is where we have to be. A little bit further. Oh, I have to turn around. This way. I should 
try one of the keys. Oh, there we go. But I am pretty used to the traveling, the climbing, the scaling. They did a wonderful job with that. Should be almost there. And then probably a duel awaits. There it is. Or maybe a map. Ha. <laughs> These legendary tales, they make us travel a lot. The will learn of its power firsthand. Sturdy. What, we did it? Light. Slay. Oh, we did it! The unbreakable Gosaku. Let's see what this armor can do. Armor worn by Gosaku, defender of Tsushima's farmers. Moderate increase to health, increase to staggered damage. Killing a staggered enemy restores 10% of health. I like that. But I would like to see this armor in black or white, to be honest. Yeah, we can equip this. We earned it. And maybe now I can do a mask again. Like this. And the headband. Okay, let's watch this too then. Yeah, that fits. Something else? Upgrade available. Yeah, I'm gonna do this after the video. And then maybe I'm gonna visit the white dye merchant again. And see if I can turn this armor into something shiny. What's the next thing we're gonna do? We have options, at least. <laughs> Look at this. Uh, actually, I would like to start the Spirit of Yarikawa's Vengeance to get the that cool new technique, Dance of Wrath. I, I think I've seen that in a video somewhere or in a trailer, and um, surely that's one that I want in my skill set. So let's highlight this one and find a spot where we can fast travel to i think uh i think this is the closest one yeah come on harse Bring me to Yarikawa. Nah. I don't want to do standoffs the whole time. I've done that enough in the beginning of the game. I think in every video I do, I've done like two or three. I'll make some time for that. Rebels retire, Mongol territory. Yet another thing I will do later. Okay, now we... Let's go. Oh yeah, the reason that I'm taking a small detour is because I don't want to mess around with um, this mission right here, Kenji. 
we will visit him another time as well. Don't worry. Yeah, we are doing close to everything in this game. I want to at least show you all the things you can do and then I kind of do the most, I wouldn't say irrelevant, but I will say it anyway, the most uh, irrelevant thing or the, the minor missions. I do those by myself because you have seen them already. And um, then everything else like Tale of Masako or Ishikawa or Norio and the legendary tales and some side quests and of course the main story. Those are all the things I do because they are very important of course to this game and to this let's play. Okay, I think it's time for a swim. Almost there? Yeah, a little bit to the right. That's Yamato. What do you think of my new armor, dude? Old is a dangerous place. What happened here? We were coming down the road and heard screams. By the time we got here, it was too late. They must have killed each other. No. It was the spirit of Yarikawa's vengeance. A spirit? You know some of the tale, but not all. Long ago, the samurai of clan Yarikawa were the most skilled swordsmen on our island. In every generation, one lord was taught their family secret, a deadly technique called the Dance of Wrath that could cut through any foe's defense. The Dance of Wrath found its greatest master in Lord Tokiasa Yarikawa. Though beloved by his people, he resented Clan Shimura's power. Desperate to seize control, he set off a bloody rebellion that claimed countless lives. Lord Shimura's father and brothers fell to Yarikawa's Dance of Wrath technique. But with Clan Sakai's aid, Shimura put down the rebellion and executed Lord Yarikawa. Before he died, the traitor vowed to avenge his conquered people from beyond the grave. Now they leave offerings to his spirit at shrines in old Yarikawa's ruins. They beg for their enemies to die, and the spirit of Yarikawa's vengeance answers their calls with the Dance of Wrath. Awesome story. You believe these men were killed by that spirit? They were merchants known for cheating their customers, profiting from deceit. So someone prayed for their deaths? The shrines overflow with offerings to the spirit, begging him for bloody retribution. How do I find these shrines? People burn a handful of straw and flower petals to make smoke, so the spirit finds their prayers. Look to the sky, my lord. The spirit of Yarikawa's vengeance. Be careful. Yarikawa's people haven't forgotten your clan's role in their downfall. That was a long time ago. Not to them. Search old Yarikawa for white smoke. White smoke. <laughs> yeah. Are we supposed to climb up here? To have some kind of bird's view? Smoke. An offering to the spirit. Well, it is the only smoke, so... Then let's go there. Oh, 
Oh, not good. A shrine to the spirit of Yeriko's vengeance. Someone left a message. Read scroll. Haitaro is a traitor to her people. He is at the camp nearby. End his worthless life. Heitaro is a traitor to Oh, Heitaro. He's at the camp nearby. End his worthless life. They must mean the survivor camp. I said it in the German way. Haitaro. Lord Sakai, how can we help you? Everyone knows me around here. Which one of you is Hetaro? I am. Someone asked the spirit of Yarikawa's vengeance to kill you. Why would they do that? He's a Mongol spy. Sneaks off every night for hours. Won't say where he goes. I've done nothing wrong. If you're helping the Mongols, I will find out. I would never do that. Please, let me prove it. Fine, Make prove it. Confess, my lord. I'll explain, but not here. Follow me. Okay. But don't try anything silly now. Where is he? Oh. I can't believe they prayed for my death. You should be more concerned about me. Unlike the spirit, I'm real. But my lord, I've seen it. Really? Where? On the road. Three bandits tried to rob me. The spirit cut their throats and vanished. This is where I come at night, my lord. A grave? Who's buried here? His name was Tojiro. We were... close. But his wife and family were at the camp. I can't explain why I visit without hurting them. I understand. But the people at your camp don't, and they're scared. It's not safe for you. Where else can I go? Make your way to Ariake. Go, before it's too late. Thank you, my lord. Search old Yarikawa for white smoke, so... I think we're gonna get a, a few stories here. I can't see more smoke from here. So, uh, that might be it. Gonna search for higher ground. Right over there. I think from that point we can find some white smoke. Is that it? Over there? This is a creepy place. Maybe some wraiths will come out. Oh, I think that might be something. It's a bit far. Somewhere we can climb down. Because I'm not jumping. I've tried that before. Doesn't end well. It's cool that you, you can actually hear his armor move when you're running. So 
Someone left a message for the spirit of Yarikawa's vengeance. The Mongols enslave our people. They camp along the Kushi River not far from this shrine. Destroy them. The Mongols enslave our people. They camp along the Kushi River. I already read that, dude. Destroy them. This is my fight, not the spirits. Man, you're already the hero of this story. Give me something too, alright? He is the one we have to destroy? Everyone's dead. Let me out! Please, my lord! I will. Calm down. I'll free you. Let me investigate Killed first. Them. It took impressive skill to kill them. The spirit cut down the horses. I've got this feeling that the guy who is trapped in there might have done this and he wants to trick me by releasing him and then getting me off guard. I wouldn't be surprised. Did I investigate the whole camp? I want to make sure to investigate everything before I let him go. There, this guy. Not Mongols. Ours. Why were they killed? And why is he alive? Tell me what happened. The spirit. He cut through them all. Then he left. Thought I was going to die in a cage. Who were these people with the Mongols? They're the ones who sold me to them. You're free. Go. Oh, thank you. Okay. The spirit moved on. So maybe I was wrong. The shrine. More white smoke. Yeah, more white smoke. Probably on the other side this time. Let's get the horsey. Need your help, buddy. On the other side of the hill, probably. Oh, what? Huh? What? Three arrows and I'm dead? Wah. Okay, let's do that again, huh? That's probably something I have to do another time. Maybe during a mission. Where is the last smoke? There it is. Or at least I suppose it's going to be the last one. So let's scale down here. Is that the right word? Scale down? Or should I say descend? It's not like I am an English dictionary, but... I like words, and I like utilizing the right ones. Here it is. Hopefully the last one. Another shrine to the spirit. If there was a message here, the spirit already claimed it. A battle close by. I love it when, immediately after he says, we have to go there, the wind guides me. Where is this battle? I can hear swords clanging, so it's probably here somewhere. And yelling. The 
spirit. Search for the spirit. You know what? If I was still wearing my white armor, people probably would be thinking, oh no, there he is, the spirit. Let's just climb up here. Yeah. Be safe. Wrong side? Do I have to investigate this guy? No. Well, he is here somewhere. There's a way in through that opening below. Ah. I love it when I'm right. Someone's been living here for a long time. Written by an educated hand. But the words are nonsense. Something about the Lord Yarikawa being alive. Oh, infested with fleas. Worn by a samurai of Yarikawa. Offerings taken from the shrines to the spirit. A banner of Clan Yarikawa. Did a samurai of Clan Yarikawa survive? So it seems. I have to find whoever this is. Need to look for another shrine offering. Another shrine offering? Man. <laughs> I see it. Sakai is the last of his clan, and a servant of the dog Shimura. Lead him to the Garden of the Gods so they may witness his death. Whoa! Prayer to the spirit. To kill me, I'll go to the Garden of the Gods and end this. And where might that be? Oh, it's close. And then there's gonna be another duel. Looking forward to it. My lord. Yes. What do you know about the Garden of the Gods? Only that it's a beautiful field of white flowers. All right. But dangerous, right? <laughs> Where do I have to go? It's in this area. Probably over there, right? Let's check that out. By white flowers, do they mean fireflies? Because this is pretty. Wow. The spirit! He was just here! Those are a lot of fireflies. You saw the spirit? Where did he go? Toward the garden of the gods. That must be why all the fireflies have gathered there. Alright, then we have to go here. This is really cool. White flowers. Statues of and this gods. is gonna be the duel. This must be their garden. A shrine. No spirit. Not yet. 
This note's addressed to me. Yarikawa's vengeance has come for you. Hmm. Yarikawa's vengeance has come for you. So you're the spirit. I am the wind that stirs the ashes. I am Yarikawa's vengeance. You spill blood using a technique that died with the clan of traitors. Who are you? A samurai's daughter? Did you survive the rebellion? Oh, we're getting an audience. No one survived. This is a land of ghosts. Who asked you to kill me? The peasants who bow to you. The merchants who smile as you pay them. All Yarikawa prays for the death of Clan Sakai and Shimura. Not everyone. Some forgive. The rest weep for revenge. I will bring them comfort. Then let's do it. <laughs> wow, wow. <laughs> Yarikawa is your grave. Fast. You never should have come. Oh my god. I'm not gonna make it, I think. Man, these duels they get harder the faster the further you progress into them. Damn it. Gonna have to do that again. Ah. Oh. At last. <sighs> Is your grave? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> 
This time I'm gonna do it, I think. You. What do you Learning. think? I know how to defeat you. No, you will die. Oh, yes. You are a great warrior. But you that rage blind you to the true I enemy. I did it. The dance of wrath belongs to me now. I use it as you should have. Omokade's Revenge, Inhuman Strength and the Venomous Onslaught. Let's look what that is. Ooh, colorful. Let's equip it. Why not? And now we probably have that new technique, no? Let's see if it's in our techniques. Stances? No. Yeah, it's right there. Unleash three consecutive unblockable attacks that inflict high damage. Wow, that looks so cool. All right, everyone, I'm going to end the episode here. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking and subscribing. And you can leave a comment what you think about the game. Stay freaky, be nice to your friends and your family, and read a goddamn book. See you in the next one.